Okay, round and round and round, we made a centrifuge. I think we're one step closer. Um, so I guess this is useful for like ore or dust, right? So if, if if you look at any ore in the game, iron ore. Oh, I guess that's not an ore, huh? <laughs> I had too many spaces. All right. So what do I do with iron ore? You might ask. I love how Greg Tech has this little fancy chart um, on what to do with it. So step one. Macerate it. Okay, easy enough. Step two, you can either macerate it again from crushed iron ore to impure, or you can then centrifuge after that to get iron ore. And there's like so many different um, options here, actually. You can put it in a bath, you know, you can take a bath with it. And you can get nickel dust, which is interesting because nickel dust is very useful in getting. Um, what is it useful for? I think it's called like an EBF. Anyways, so this one you can uh, you can there was a step. Okay, let, let, let's let's see what the step was. I, I glossed over it. So centrifuge. So we can get we have purified ore after we um, washed it. Okay, we need a we need an ore washing plant basically, uh, or a centrifuge, a thermal centrifuge because we have a normal centrifuge. But anyways, what is this? Centrifuge. Oh, centrifuge ironer. Okay, which also gets you iron dirt. Okay, got it, got it, got it. So we have the, we have the macerator again after we washed it. We get purified iron ore dust and 10 dust 10%. And then if you centrifuge it, you can get that iron dust w without having to wash it, basically. And then also another 10% 10. So very useful, very useful. Um, and we get a large steel fluid cell. Nice. That's pretty useful, I'd say. All right, so now, now we can probably make glue, right? We just need, okay, well, we already have congealed green slime, I believe. Actually, I have trees if I don't have, oh my, what did I just do? I just clicked that with that, um, okay. Where's my, um, my extractor's over here. Good, we have, okay, I was making, <laughs> I was extracting all my slime. Okay, so we have 11, so now, make good circuit boards, you need a glue or refined glue. Okay, you can attain blah, blah, blah by centrifuging sticky resin or distilling glue. That sounds easy enough. So we have a centrifuge. We definitely need to <laughs> remodel our base because these are these machines are stacking up um, a lot and it's it's getting uh, concerning. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right. Um. Give me like 10 minutes. I'm going to redesign my base to be more streamlined. All right. So I have streamlined my process of, uh, well, I'm a little bit worried here, actually, of water. Uh, <laughs> but I mean, by water, I mean, uh, <laughs> like these machines, I think if they get water on them, they'll start like raining. Or if it rains on them, I think it'll start like setting fires or something like that. So I just got to make sure um, they're not impacted by water. <laughs> I, I I don't think water, like, it's not water. I think it's rain. But yeah, so streamline the, you can't see the wires anymore. So that's, that's good. Also, I have my cool drying racks here. Um, so this room's a lot cleaner now. So this is kind of like my steam boiler room, as they say. And uh, goes underground into a centrifuge. So now we are making glue. Perfect. Okay. So, oh, what the? Did I just take a hit? That was interesting. But anyway, so what we need now is refined glue cell, which we can make by, I, I have no idea how to make this. <laughs> um, so, sorry, the requirements for this were a fluid extractor, right? So I'm assuming I just have to pipe in um, fluids and then extract them with the fluid extractor. I'm like abusing this 10 recipe, by the way, or the, the coins. I don't know if it's abusing is the word, but like on cooldown, I'm using it. Oh crap, I don't even have enough. Cause like you get so many of these uh, technician things for um, just doing things like, why would I ever make, <laughs> why would I ever make any 10 cable myself? To be fair, that's like the only thing I use here. 
I guess raw raw iron could be useful. Let me see how many black iron black ingots I get. Black smith ingots. Yeah, I can do that as well because black like the only way to make raw iron now for me is to well how do I make it? I yeah, the raw iron ingots, which I, I get by smelting the iron ingots. So that's that's kind of a pain right now. Um, I'm sure there's there's later like later ways to do it with the arc furnace, I believe. But yeah, all right. So I gotta I'm gonna figure out the what do I got? The fluid extractor. So extract fluid from items. So basically, I can put the fluid into an item. So let me create that item and then extract it so we can continue with this. Okay. So I made the glue. I think I will pick. Um, probably empty cell. No, empty cells. No, Ooh, empty cells. Empty cells. All right. So I made the glue with this thing. So this is how I can make rubber dust from these congealed slimes, which I haven't really used too much rubber dust. It's like I, I only used it like initially, um, but now I can use rubber dust as well as sulfur to make the um, the, the rubber sheets a little bit easier. So that that's useful, I guess. But now, I guess my next step is the circuit board, which is, um, I need a phenolic circuit board. This is interesting. Oh, I got the chemist. What is this? Did I like unlock something new in the coin store? Let's see. Chemist, hollow glasses I'm using, creosote and glue. Oh yeah, okay, look at that. I can make... <laughs> 64 refined glue with 25 chemists. Seems overpriced. Um, or, I mean, I need 65, 64 empty cells. That, that's the over... I mean, I get it. It makes sense. You can't just get random... Oh, wait, I need... What? What do I need? Oh, 25 of the chemists won. These are just the chemists. And wait, how do I do that? Oh, and it's simpler. Okay with i guess you can set the circuit jeez i can't miss the hundred okay that's insane i guess oh no i do have chemist one okay so that, that's i can make glue any or buy glue anytime at the grocery store i guess notably i could buy what creosote as well oh i don't know why i want creosote oh maybe for like the creosote engine maybe i feel like the ingots are probably what i want to buy the most Anyways, um, all right. So I guess now I want to make that circuit board, right? The empty one. So I need wood pulp and a phenolic. What is this? Oh, okay. This is actually pretty cool. A good boy. <laughs> so either sawdust. Wait, what? Oh, and glue or molten bisphenol A. Of course, of course. No horses were harmed in the production. What? How are horses even related to glue? That's got to be like an inside joke, right? Uh, I don't even know. Okay, so I guess I got to put the glue. So ideally, I, I pipe the glue into the assembler here. Maybe I, I, I get like, um yeah, I got to pipe it into the assembler. So maybe I put these too far apart. Um, Let me, let me switch that now, actually. Before I forget, do, 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 do. Okay. Assembler's there. We can put the leaf back over here. And I added some space for uh, <laughs> the eventual rise of the machines. All right. Um, I don't. Okay. Will it automatically output? Let's see. I don't think it will. Oh, it automatically output the item, which I don't want. Uh, oh, wait. What is this? Hold shift for more info. Oh, left click a fluid container to fill empty the tank. Right click to process one item per click. Okay. Um, item output. I I'm not really sure with these machines. I gotta. I guess I, this is something I just gotta you know use to understand. All right. I think we're finally getting to the real age of using Steam because uh, I uh my Steam my forced my I guess I had three Steam boilers right two solar ones um and the uh, the small tiny coal one that you start with 
they were enough to make what was i making the the circuit right this circuit it wasn't enough to make this phenolic processor right i i was making i was barely able to make the 32,000 eu ones over 120 seconds but i think that was that was the limit right i even waited like i i stopped all my machines and i even waited to make sure like this filled up all my wires and everything was filled up it was just at the end maybe if i waited like a little bit longer to fill it up like a little bit more it would have been good but it did not work um so i uh, i guess i had a couple options i could what the hell am i taking damage from what the hell is this what was that okay <laughs> um that's interesting is it because it's next to this that's probably it actually yeah, you probably can't have... <laughs> I'm so confused what just happened there. You probably can't have... Well, I mean, this lava probably isn't it. It's most likely because it was next to wood, right? Let me remove this as well. That was very strange. Okay. Well, good thing I got that in camera. <laughs> Hopefully I did anyways. Could just be talking to myself again. <laughs> what the heckin'? What's going on? Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Get some help. What the? I was boiled alive. Crap, have you ever been boiled alive before? Stop, 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 stop. Jesus Christ. What's wrong? Oh, you know what's wrong? We need better pipes. We need better pipes. Because this are wood pipes, and this thing will get real hot, right? As opposed to these simple boilers which don't get that hot. Okay, well, that helps my understanding, but I'm hoping all this will generate enough beam. I don't need to go like a different route for this or maybe even make more boilers. Hopefully I don't need to do that. And I hate when I die and I gotta equip my gloves again. Like, oh my God, this is the pain, suffering. Okay, like equip there. I, I only have like a chest piece and some glasses, but come on, come on. There's gotta be a better way to do this, right? Yeah, it's, it's not dying. That's the way you do it. Oh, <laughs> uh, you think you're hot? Shit, huh? <laughs> All right. Uh, backpack. No, I'm not trying to name my backpack. Okay, I'll name it. Sure. No, stop it. What? How do I put it? It's shift, right click. What the hell? Okay, well... Whatever. I how do I how did I equip my backpack before? All right, I'm I'm having a moment right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna be. Right it's working! It's working! It's working! Okay, so all I did to fix the, my issue before was I put a small steel fluid pipe on top of my. Oh, well, look at that. <laughs> on top of my uh, coal boiler here. Actually, I just noticed this is gonna blow up. <laughs> this is gonna blow up real quick, huh? Okay, what's interesting is... How is... I guess the, the, the boiler is getting too hot, right? So it's... I don't know why I need to put steel fluid pipe here as well, though, right? It, like, this is intake. I mean, I, I guess I get it, but... Oh, man. Uh, I guess... Okay. I might need to, like, put this all steel. I mean, which is fine. I got some steel. But anyways, the important part is I got the circuit board right. Now I can macerate some more gold and go off to the races, right? To make this good circuit board. <laughs> Why is it named good circuit board? I, couldn't they just name it circuit board, you know? A good circuit all right well i think that's it for me for tonight now i have fixed my issue well i guess i have another issue though and that is this is gonna get hot right if this gets too hot it'll it'll melt things all right that's a later me problem though all right i uh, might have went afk for about a couple hours four hours or so and uh now i'm in a as you might say a situation of some sort <laughs> I think uh, one of those creepers that spawns whatever this is, um, cobblestone, came and uh, 
blew up. Uh, I, I can't even say blew up. I can't even mind this because I'll drown. <laughs> oh my gosh. I, okay, I'm on the roof, I think. My house. Oh my, this is a tragedy. <laughs> Don't ask how I got the torch. I think I found it on the wall. Maybe it was this wall. No, not, not that wall. No, I'm actually, no, I'm inside right now. Um, geez, I can't even tell. Oh, that was, I got another torch. Okay. We're making progress. Uh, oh, okay. There's the bricks. Um, what am I doing here? Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> oh, here's my, oh, this is my spawn point. Okay. So if I break this, oh, I don't want to break. Oh, wait, is that my... That's my grave, I think, actually. Wait, let's see. Yeah, right there. That's my grave. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, I guess I'm dead anyways, but... um. Oh, look, I'm back. <laughs> oh, I guess this is, uh, this is why you don't AFK in your base. Otherwise, this will happen, you know? who? How did this even happen, though? Well, if I, I guess I have to break my bed, maybe? Okay. Bread... Bread is broken. <laughs> All right, now I guess I just die, right? Um, what is this? Oh, this is a crafting table. Okay, well, I'm going to try to at least put my bed back down. Oh, you can't put your bed down underwater. What the? Okay, well, that's annoying. Uh, oh, okay, there we go. All right, at least I respawned, I guess. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go walk over back to my house. So the reason I was AFK was because uh, I have a job. <laughs> it's not playing Minecraft all day. It's going to work. So I, I was just AFK in my house because I was making like steel because it takes literally like days to make enough steel for anything. Well, maybe not for anything, but it takes like a day of just AFKing to make like 64 steel. We'll see when I get there. How much steel I've actually made. I'll probably check that first because I'm I'm talking about it now. But here's my house from uh, an angle. Yeah, I'm not. I guess I need to make one of those chandeliers that stops mob spawning. I'm gonna look at it the second I get near my house. I mean, this is probably the best outcome here because nothing was like exploded. You know. Well, I'm sorry. It's not a good outcome. I should clarify that. It's the best outcome out of the things that happened today. All right, let me go to my house and then we can make a chandelier. I, I don't know how a creeper got in here. Like if you press F7, you can see the light lines, right? Yeah, I guess a creeper could have spawned there, but I was inside my house as like, we can probably see by the death point. Let's see. Yeah, these are all inside my house here. So unless my door was closed, which I, I think it was close. I mean, and the only other way is uh, over here, right? And everything else, everything here is also, unless, like, it, it, I don't see the icons here, because there's torches everywhere, right? And like, I'm, I'm pressing F7 there, but I'm guessing that, I, I don't know for sure, but maybe it had to have spawned like out here. Um, but that's, that's unfortunate. But now, I guess, let me go back. Let me go back up. I need to get a pickaxe or something to destroy these things. Um, let me search through my belongings real quick. Um, Jesus. Okay. Well, this is really a, a problem, isn't it? Um, <laughs> okay. Um, here, let me just make a pickaxe. All right. That's probably easy to do. Or maybe I have... No, let's first check the progress of my steel. Oh, it stopped making because uh, it spawned cobblestone right here. Look at that. Okay, I'm not going to punch cobblestone today. Hopefully, I don't have to do that. Oh, my God. All right, let, let, me, um, let me come back to you with a solution to this because I can't think of one. Now, before you say, oh, yeah, just make a pickaxe. Mine your way out, right? Yeah, what happens when I make a pickaxe? It's the iron pickaxe, let's say. This tool can't be used for mining anything. You can only use for crafting. So I have to make a pickaxe made of gravel, right? And do I have any more gravel? 
Oh man, I've never been in such a conundrum before. Let me. Oh right, I forgot. Forgot to mention. What the? What just happened? How did this guy get in? Oh well, the door was open. I just got something. Press P to open the compendium. I want to do that. I want to open the compendium. <laughs> Jesus Christ! What am I getting hooked by? Get out of here. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, let me get inside. Jesus. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Kill me. Okay. Let me. Let me press P. Oh my God. Okay. What? Okay. It's an achievement. Hey. The more you know. I opened the Ender Compendium. Are these things still chasing me? They are. Yeah. Jeez. I. I don't want to. I don't want to fight them. I am a fragile human being here. <laughs> This this is probably one of the worst creepers. I mean, yeah, I could have blew up my house. So I, I'm glad it didn't blow up my house, but I'm also sad that it did this. Oh right, I need to eat. Look at that little that creeper. <laughs> this is not a creeper. Oh my <laughs> This is a really cruel creeper. Um I'm tempted to just reset, you know? I don't want to reset too much because it's like kind of, it feels cheating, you know. And I I can definitely solve my way through this. I just need to um. I don't know. I don't even know what what do I do? Uh, I guess I I have to make a pickaxe, right? Mine this. Let's see. Wait, mining this will do nothing, right? Because there's just another one underneath. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna make a pickaxe.